ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸುಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಶಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶಕ್ಕೆ ಪಾಸಿಂದು ವ್ಯವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗ ಪಂಗುಂಗ ಲಂಘಯತಿ ಗಿರಿಂ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದೆ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬಿಂದಾವೈತು ಶ್ರೀದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವಶ್ಚ ಶ್ನಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೆ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂ ಚೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರಶ್ಯ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದರುಣ್ ಧ್ಯೇಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟದೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಭಿರಿಂಚಿನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ವೇತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪನುತಪಾಲಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷತೆ ಚರುಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಪವಧೂಷ್ವಾದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರ ಸ್ವಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾಶಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಅದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಅದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾ ಬದಾತು ಶಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಯತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರು ದ್ವಿಜವರು ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ಬನ್ ಬಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋ ದಿವ್ಯೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಠಾ ಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷೀ ತವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯಮನಂಗಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವಾರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವಿಶ್ವನಾಥ ಭಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ಯ ಬದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ವಕ್ಷಸಿ ಯಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀದ್ ತ್ವಿಶಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ 
जेवा मईशे कित सौदासा जौनेशु देहांतर वार्तिकेशु गेहेशु जायात्म जराति मत्सु नौप्रीतिजुक्ता जवदार्था शलोके जेवा मईशे कित सौदार्था जौनेशु देहांतर वार्तिकेशु गेहेशु जयात्म जराति मत्सु नौप्रीतिजुक्ता जवदार्था शलोके गौरिय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी जगत प्रभुपाल परमंश जगदगुरु सेठ वैष्णवाज आर वेरी प्लेन हार्टेड सरल दोष वैष्णवाज आ वेरी सिंपल हार्ट सरल सरल मीन इनसाइड एंड आउटसाइड सेम नो डुप्लिसिटी गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमंश जगदगुरु सेट दैट वैष्णवास आर वेरी प्लेन हार्टेड सरल देर इज नो कम्प्लीकेसी देर इन सरलता इज वैष्णवता भक्ति मुझ ठाकुर राइटिंग सरलता इज वैष्णवता नो सरल भाव नो वैष्णव सरलता वैष्णवता सो परमहंस गुरु वैष्णव प्रोपा स्पीकिंग दोज आर परमहंस गुरु वैष्णव दे आर ऑल वेरी प्लेन हार्टेड प्लेन हार्टेड मीन दे आर कंप्लीटली अटैच विथ भगवान श्री कृष्ण देर इज नो मैटर नो मेटेरियल थिंग्स so there cannot be any complicacy complicacy not possible there in vaishnav because duplicity complex complex you know complex situation duplicity everything possible when you have some desire no desire nothing if my heart is heart and soul everything dedicated for bhagwan then there cannot be any complicacy we are hearing two kind of things one is superiority complex one is inferiority complex we have idea that in this material world two type of people you can see one is having superiority complex i am boss everybody should honor me superiority complex another is in inferiority complex if you think that krishnadas kaviraj goswami is speaking that jagai madai hoite muise papishtho purisher kit hoite muise logishtho mor naam jei loy tar punno khoy mor nai je mor naam jei shune tar pap hoy if you think that then you are speaking inferiority complex that mean krishnadas kaviraj goswami is surely having inferiority complex he is speaking this way i am much lower than the insect of the school stool you can think this way but it's totally wrong because you have no idea about the heart of a pure vaishnav when you can understand your position when you can understand the position of guru vishnav bhagwan nitananda gauranga in then naturally you can grow this kind of humbleness humbler than the blade of grass i can recite this shloka trinado bisunichana tarur vasishna amanina manodino kirtaniyo i can recite very easily but if i can apply this word this shloka in my life then i am vaishnav then other is not not vaishnavs not possible so popa speaking paramanshu guru vaishnav they are all very plain hearted saral there no complicacy very straight they love bhagwan they can see bhagwan they can see whole world in relation to bhagwan 
So they cannot be, and they don't have no demand. If at all I need some love, puja, patishtha, money, position, then I can make some duplicity with you. Then I, I can make some false harikatha. You don't know pure Guru Vaishnava, how much sacrifice they have. How much sacrifice they have so that they can speak this way. Otherwise, if they, if they are going to make some adjustment, little adjustment, little bit, they can get whole world pratishtha, money, position, everything. Little bit. Oh, it's okay. Hey, nice. Little bit. Barwali. You can get all pratishtha. You don't understand this is a pure Guru Vaishnava, how much sacrifice, how much dedication they have. They are going to kick out their own love puja pratishtha. They don't care. The whole world can go against me, can speak, cannot give me. I cannot get popularity, anything. Everybody can reject my Harikatha. But Popa is not teaching this. Popa is teaching us, if the whole world is going to reject me, still I am not going to change my Siddhanta. If the whole world is going to reject me, even those who already have come to me to accept me as their perceptor, one by one, if they are going to leave me and go away, still I am going to stand under the lotus-like, lotus feet of Guru Padma, umbrella-like lotus feet of Guru Padma, and I, without any fear, I can go on speaking about the absolute truth, absolute way. I cannot change my Siddhanta. People now in confusion, they cannot understand what is Siddhanta, what I am speaking. Same thing Popa told before leaving world. They were leaving this world, Popa told. Now, nobody understands my Siddhanta Vichar. Nobody wants to accept my Vichar. What I can do by staying here in this material world anymore? Now they are not going to accept me. By that time, already infighting started. It is the arrangement of Sometimes Jogumaya, sometimes Mahamaya, both. Time to time we'll have to discuss. Not that everything Mahamaya. Popat, before leaving this world, he told. Popat never wanted to make any compromise within Sahajya, any wrong Siddhanta, nothing. Popat was ready to give his body. People, Sahajya, they wanted to kill him. But still Popat, Bhakti Siddhanta, they never wanted to Changes Siddhanta Vichya. Popa speaking, Paramahansa Guru Vaishnava, they are Saral. Bhakti Mithyaka speaking, Saralata is Vaishnavata. Otherwise, yes. there is no There is no Vaishnavata cannot be there. It's a big problem. Now, people are in confusion. Whom to accept? What Siddhanta? Because you are speaking this. That Maharaj speaks this. That Maharaj already told this. Sometimes I am tearing my hair and crying. People cannot accept me, I know. Because there is confusion. Whom to accept? There is some Siddhanta Vishar. I like to give some example. Suppose there is different Puran. Suppose there is, there is different Puran. And this Puran is speaking this, and this Puran speaking this. And what Siddhanta we can say? This Puran speaking this, because different Purans was compiled for different purposes. Six, six Shatik Puran, six Rajasik Puran, six Tamasik Puran. And if somebody is start fighting with me by giving the judgment from Puran, Tamasik Puran, I am going to speak the absolute Siddhanta Vijara Bhagavatam, then who can decide who is speaking right? Yesterday I told. Big problem now. 
if Puran Puran different problem, confusion, then you will have to accept the Bishar there from Bhagavatam. Because Puran time to time they are compiling for different purpose. There is some inner meaning. Sometimes they like to project Brahma, Rajasik Pura, Tamasik, they like to project Shankar Bhagavan. Shatik Puran going to project Shankar, uh, Vishnu. So all in confusion. So you will have to approach Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati. It is my request. If you don't like to grow your complicacy, then you must approach Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur or Bhakti Vinod Thakur is very, very practical. Somebody is speaking that Vaishnavas are sometimes cheating. And I also believe. I also believe. Vaishnavas sometimes cheating. When cheating? When they find I am a cheater. First of all, my Guru Maharaj wanted to appreciate me one day. One day, I started closing my eyes and go away. Guru Maharaj, I don't like to hear. You like to cheat me. From then onward, Guru Maharaj could realize he don't like to hear appreciation. Before hearing, before hearing my appreciation from Guru Padma, I like to die. Nothing more dangerous. Try to hear, nobody can speak this Siddhanta. Never, you can search all internet. I'm speaking what, what, what told. Vaishnavas sometimes like to cheat me. But when they discover, I cannot cheat him. He likes to serve Guru Padma absolutely. Then he stopped appreciating disciple. Nothing more dangerous, nothing more dangerous, nothing more dangerous than hearing personal appreciation, appreciation from Guru Padma. Nothing more dangerous than hearing my personal appreciation from Guru Vishnu. I like to die before hearing. Better if they kill me, if they like to kick me, slap me. I, uh, I like very much. I am not so foolish. If they kick me, ah, you have done this. Huh? Like to slap me, you idiot, what you have done, Seva? I am very happy. Oh, now they are going to give me kippah. I am giving your answer. You can remember, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu sometime wanted to cheat public. Like Ballavacharya wanted to cheat to him. Brahmananda Bharati. Brahmananda Bharati. Ballavacharya, 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 Mahaprabhu speaking. When Svanathan Rup. Sanatana was not there. Rupa Goswami Pad was there. In Arail Gram, Elihavad, that side of the river. Anupam and Rupa Goswami. Try to remember this Siddhanta. Don't forget. You can never hear this. When Balabhata, Balabhacharya wanted to pay pranam to Rupa Goswami Pad and Anupam, they are running. Don't pay. We are fallen soul. We are fallen soul. We are... Mahaprabhu speaking, you are so great, you are so great, so elevated personality, you have so, so you don't pay, they are actually, they are actually low grade, Mahaprabhu purposely cheating, Mahaprabhu cheating Balvachari, Balvachari, they are actually low caste. Then Balvacharju, I think you are joking with me, Balvacharju could realize Mahaprabhu cheating, I think you are, you are joking with me. Always Krishna Nam, they are dancing in their tongue. They cannot be a fallen soul. This way, time to time, Mahaprabhu wanted to cheat Balavacharya. Mahaprabhu wanted to cheat Brahmananda Bharti. Mahaprabhu, you are, you are Shakshat Brahma. So in Nilachal Dham, when we appear, when you come here, then two Brahma, one is Jagannath and Mahaprabhu would like to cheat him. Brahmananda Bharti. Time to time I can show you 
how Mahaprabhu wanted to cheat. How wanted to how Mahaprabhu wanted to cheat foolish public. Mahaprabhu wanted to. And Vaishnavas, Prabhupada also, giving big honor to one of his disciples or somebody. Big honor in big assembly. You are the so nice, you know, your Harikatha, oh, so nice you are lecturer. Follow, they are speaking. Papa speaking, somebody, you are my goddess. But they all fall down. Some Vaishnav can give me big title, big title to cheat me. But Papa never wanted to get any title from anybody. Any title from anybody. He could easily collect so many titles. It's very interesting. Now it is my question to you. We can follow Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Nitananda Prabhu, or if you can speak me, Mara, some Saktavis avatar is there, Parshuram. Try to understand what I mean to say. I can follow Parshuram. I am asking you, you give me answer. Parshuram is Shaktabesh Avatar. I can follow Parshuram or I can follow Gauranga Mapu, whom I can follow. You speak me. Eh? Is Shaktabesh Avatar. Shaktabesh Avatar. I can follow him. Why not? Why not? And his disciple. I mean, one, one of twelve Mahajan. Guru Rapi, Avalitapsha. Guru Rapi, Avalitapsha. Eh? Guru Rapi, Avalitapsha. Akarja, Akarja, Majanato, Utprata, Patipanasha, Paritag, Vidhiyate. Are One Mahajan. Is one Mahajan out of twelve Mahajan. I can follow, I can follow Parshuram or I can follow his disciple. It's my question to you. To, eh? to whom? Pitama Vishwa. Whom to follow? Bhagavad speaking, you can follow. Bhagavad speaking, you can follow Pitama Vishwa. Prahlad Visma Janako Balir Vaya, so many. Sangur Naro the Sammu Kumaru Kupilo Manu, Prahlad Visma Janako Balir Vaya Sagravayam, Dado Saita Vijanimo, Dharmang Bhagavatam Bhatta, Guyam Vishuddham Durvadyam, Jadgyata Amrita Mashpate. My question to you You cannot attack me, you can try to attack me, but you cannot save yourself. I told you, any direction, right, left, up, down, anywhere you can attack me, you cannot stand. Because I am depending upon Prabhupada. You forget this point. You forget this vital point. I depend upon only on Prabhupada. Only on Prabhupada. So, there can be so many Shakta Vesavata. Buddha also coming. Shankarajaja also coming. Shakta I mean, uh, Shankara going to miss Guy. Rishabdev coming, Dattateo coming, Dattateo also Shaktaves Avatar. So do you like to follow Shaktaves Avatar? Do you like to follow this Dattateo? I am asking to you, my question to you. You can follow Dattateo, he is Shaktaves Avatar. Do you like to follow Parshuram? Shaktaves Avatar. What do you, who, whom you like to follow? Vaishnav sometimes can cheat you by giving big, big title to you. But I can prove they wanted to cheat you. Even Shaktave Zavutar can make mistake. Or should I make a mistake? Is Brahman is going to kill. Kill. Going to kill, huh? Thousands of killing. And Pitama Bhisha speaking, this kind of guru, 
who is speaking all wrong. What to do, not to do, have no idea. Doing all aparat, they should be rejected. Pitama Vishwa speaking. So whom I can accept? Guru Rapi, Avalitapsho, Karja Karja Majanato, Utpata Patibanyasha, Parityaga Vidhiyate. It is the rules to live it. Now world, whole world in confusion. This Acharya wrote this thing. This Acharya told this thing. Big confusion. Where to go? And I am speaking this way. Completely Siddhanta Prabhupada. Totally. I am depending upon whole Siddhanta Vicharan Prabhupada. Now whom to follow, whom not to follow, that's up to you. Because I have no expectation from you. I have no expectation. My Harikatha is free of cost. My life is dedicated for Harikatha. Harikatha is not my business. I am, I am not going to act as a pros by the help of Harikatha. So now it's up to you what to do. You can think what to do. So many confusion. How to harmonize? This Ajajyo speaking, this about him. This Ajajyo speaking, this Ajajyo. Then I, I am all speaking about Absolute Siddhanta Prabhupada. So it is so it is good. I think it is my suggestion. If there is any confusion among different Siddhanta, you can depend upon Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Krishna. Like different Purans, confusion, you have to depend on Bhagavatam. Like different Acharya speaking this. Okay, maybe some some big achai can make you know, reconcile, but it will take time. And also, maybe you cannot accept it. If I say, Siddhar Goswami, I wanted to cheat you, you cannot believe me. How? How possible? He told. Whereas I am going to give evidence from Bhagavatam, all from Prabhupada, this, that, but still, because all, they are in confusion. What to do? Now situation so complicated. Now situation so complicated. Almost all over the world, actual Harikatha is off, totally off. All over the world, actual Harikatha almost off. Almost. I am not speaking 100%. Then I can make offense. Almost off. Nobody likes to speak about. They like to speak with some measurement, calculation, so that Harikatha can speak. He cannot become angry, he cannot be can support this act. But I have no expectation. I have no expectation. So, day by day I am speaking about our Guru Bhargava, glorification of our Guru Bhargava. Now, today is the appearance day of Sila Bhakti Bicha Jajavar Goswami Maharaj. His heart was so simple, so simple, plain-hearted, no complicacy. You don't know. Nobody can speak you. How you can know? How you can know? So plain-hearted. He came to Prabhupada. He came to Prabhupada. Actually, he took birth in a very high family, Brahman family, Orisha, Orisha Brahman family. Orisha Brahman family, he took birth. Very high family. His name was Sarveshwar Panda. Panda, you know? Sarveshwar Panda, title. He went to Jagannath Puri in young age. His education going on, he is making education. Educational qualification also there. Higher education, not done. Not higher education, but education done. Higher education, not done. According to your calculation. But all education done, very nicely. And he went to Jagannath Mandir to pray unto a lotus feet of Jagannath and Baladev to arrange Gurudev, who is my Guru. He was very much interested to do bhajan from very young age. He wanted to do bhajan. But where from I can get guru? 
somehow by the mercy of Jagannath, Bhagavan and Balaram, he got some clue from Buddhan Maharaj, one of disciple of Prabhupada. Immediately he wanted to run to see who is that great personality, Prabhupada. Wanted to see. Finally, what happens? After watching the lotus feet of Prabhupada, he was bound to submit himself unto his lotus feet. He was bound to submit. So attraction, so power. Finally, what happens? In the year of 1926, he was given Harinam and Diksha at a time. Because Vaishnavas can realize they don't like to give mantra because they like to test. If they break down, if something happens, better, better wait for some time more. Don't take any hasty decision. Try to wait and watch. Because who knows, your mood can change. You can take some different mood can. So it's good that you are getting facility. Now your everything is under almost under control. You are, you are trying to get control over your fanciful mind. So it's good to wait more. Otherwise, diksha and everything become very cheap. Very cheap. Like in the market available now, all cheap thing, it become very cheap. Now, diksha is very cheap. Everywhere available. Sannasi, diksha, no standard, no quality, nobody going to pass any judgment. You want? Or if you don't want, I can give you sannas. Come, come, come. This is the condition. Quality and qualification, nobody likes to judge. Bhakti Mataka told. Bhakti Mataka is speaking at present. Bhakti Mataka is speaking in his article. I can show you. At present, nobody interested to look for quality, qualification, everything, nobody likes to. Like to. This way, Bhakti Mataka writing in Upadesha and the commentary, this way our whole Sampradaya become contaminated. Bhakti Mata writing. Bhakti Mata writing. Today also I reside in Hindi, Hindi Karikata. Totally our Sampradaya become contaminated. All go to water. All energy given by Prabhupada, Bhakti Mata Tagore, all now going to water. Now everybody likes to apply the formula of brain drain. You know brain drain? You don't know brain drain? You don't know brain drain? At the time of British, British people, they are very clever. British people, very clever. They used to, they used to apply this formula, brain drain. They used to come, because their country is very small, their brain is very high. That's why British colonial rule, Hong Kong, these are so many big, all over the world, they wanted to dominate people. Follow. Their brain so hard. Any man having very nice quality, very nice quality, you can engage him in such a nice seva, he can come out successful. Follow. But the British people used to apply such a rule so that his brain can go to drain. You don't understand now. His brain can go to drain. Drain, you know? Drain. Where all water, urine going again. Brain drain. You don't understand. Very old. In India, almost all old men, they have idea. They know this word. Brain drain. In mort also. I am not speaking lie. Bhagavatam is in front of me. I am keeping Bhagavatam at present. In mort Mandir also in society, they are thinking, this man is very powerful, these are, oh, then make him out of society. Or they like to make brain drain. I know personally, they also wanted to apply this formula with me. They are giving me honor, but I am not so foolish. 
They are giving on Maharaj, you can do this seva. Giving, giving. After some time, they wanted to play such a trick so, the, so that I can break my heart. Oh, useless. All my five years' energy gone. They can give you energy. After that, after five years, after taking all your blood, everything, energy, they can prove all your energy useless because you are not successful. They can prove it purposely. Those rascal could not come out successful. They wanted to play this trick with me, but they couldn't be. They wanted to play, but they don't know my idea, my bichar coming from up. Balaji Maharaj giving me. So when they are speaking nice, nice letter, everything, I read, I can understand they are false. Any letter, you show me, I read, any word I can say, they are going to cheat me. I throw this letter. I know they like to cheat me. They like to put me in trouble. This way, Bhagavan always like to save me. Always like to save me. So, this Jajavar Goswami Maharaj, Sarveshwar Panda, Prabhupada, in the year of 1926, he, Prabhupada was ready to give Harinam and Diksha in the year of 1926 to him. Follow. Very plain hearted. Very nice. He used to take the responsibility of the seva of Radha Govinda in Chaitanya Mahat. In Chaitanya Mahat deity, Prabhupada watching his very purity of heart, mind, body, everything, Prabhupada wanted to give the responsibility of the temple. You take this temple. After that, he started reading Vyakaran, Harinamitu Vyakaran in the institution. Higher education was not done, but still was very powerful in Siddhanta Vichar. Higher education was not done, but still, his Siddhanta which are everything very, very nice. So, and his Kirtan, main point, Popat could realize, Popat could realize by watching his face, he is a hundred percent inclined soul, which is the most vital point at present. Popat could realize he is a hundred percent dedicated soul. He can never cheat me. Popat could realize. So, Prabhupada was very happy and by the order of Prabhupada, he used to do kirtan, very nice kirtan. His voice was so nice, even Prabhupada used to hear kirtan, used to hear kirtan. In different dharma sabha, different place, he used to sing kirtan from heart. His kirtan was so heart-touching. If you hear one line, it can change your heart. So nice kirtan. Even if you don't understand the meaning of the kirtan, but that is transcendental word. Transcendental word, transcendental word, transcendental sound. So, transcendental sound is not depending upon any language. Transcendental sound means it's coming from up. So, he used to do kirtan in different place and he was given very nice one title, very nice title. Very nice title he was given. A very nice singer, very nice song he used to do. And serving Prabhupada, he took responsibility in different places. In Chaitanya Mahat, here, there. Very nice devotee. After that, one very Fantastic incident happened in the life of Jayavad Goswami Maharaj. Popat wanted to give sannyas to him. Popat wanted to give sannyas to him. But he was not ready. Popat, he was... Come on, that Popat waiting for 20 years, 30 years, watching a man, what is mood. But he wanted to suggest, I, I like to give you sannyas. Prabhupada, I don't like to take sannyas because I don't know. In my horoscope it is written that I can go to start my family life. Prabhupada laughing. He is speaking the whole incident. One Brahmachari and this Sarveshwar 
Panda, my Brahmachari. Both of them. One very good astrologer, very big Pandit. After watching the plum, you know, palmist, you know, by watching, he forecast if you are not going to marry, marriage is a hundred percent. If not marriage, then I can leave my astrology. Because marking there to Jajavar Gusai Maj and to another Brahmachari. Another Brahmachari. But Jajavar Gusai Maharaj already took shelter on the Lotus Vira Popa sincerely. And that Brahmachari, not sincerely. Jajavar Gusai Maharaj, 100% dedicated soul. When I am when I am 100% dedicated soul unto a Lotus Vira Popa and Gurudev, then it is a responsibility of Gurudev and Popa to save me. You don't understand this point. When I am 100% dedicated soul, under the lotus feet of Popad and you know, Gurudev, then it is the responsibility of Popad and Gurudev to save me. It is not my tension. What will happen? I am speaking this way. I have no tension. Because I know I am not speaking lie. People are in confusion. They are also innocent. What I can do for that? They are in confusion. From different corner, different Siddhanta come. They cannot understand. What is this? It seems Samba was speaking right. But I would say, why you are speaking this way? They are in confusion. They cannot understand. Tally. So, Chayadavar Goswami Maharaj was 100% dedicated soul unto the Lord of Sri Prabhupada, but that Brahmachari was not. So, the palmist, I mean the astrologer was very perfect prediction. That Brahmachari was bound to go away from temple, he was bound to marry. But that was not the case with Sarveshwar Brahmachari. Because 100% dedicated. When Sarveshwar Prabhu told to Prabhupada, Prabhupada, some astrologer told, also my father also, his father also big, you know, astrologer. He told, marriage is a must in your life. Popat smiling. Okay, you do bhajan, you need not play your head over that. Popat only smiling. You do your bhajan, it is, you need not play your head. Because Popat know it very well. What is written in hand, that can be changed by my bhajan. Many such cases. My Guru Maharaj was supposed to leave body within 68. But due to tremendous bhajan, his lifespan started in case. 100 cross, 100 two. Follow. So many things. So many things written in hand, but you need, you need not play your head. Automatically, after some two, five years, when that astrologer meet with Sarveshwar Prabhu, he say, how possible? It's a miracle. Let me see your hand. He watching and speaking by, by touching something very important. Impossible, miracle. How possible your handwriting changing? Puro just went. I was supposed to meet with big, big danger in my life. Big, big danger. No father can check me. But all danger gone. By the mercy of Gurudev and Prabhupada. You can, if you like to see, you can see. I am less interested. All gone. Somebody told, this group is ready to kill you. I told, okay, if they are going to kill me, I can concentrate in Harinam. Follow. But after that I came to know, they forecast one big man. Actually, some of my godbrother, he wanted to go to Varanasi. For some reason, I also went there to go to Benaras Hindi, Hindi University, BHU. Benaras Hindi University to take some information there. Also, he took me long ago, money, maybe 16, 18 years back. Or maybe 15, I forget, I cannot remember. And Kashi Vishwanath Darshan was there also. Anyway, 
So he wanted to shake his hand. And by chance, Gopananda Bon Mahara, one, uh, one Acharya of a present uh, bhajanas from a Bon Maharaj, Bon Goswami Maharaj Mall. Old man, he is above 90 years. He loved, respect me, he loved me very much. He gave me that address, you can go, your godbrother can. I was not ready to check. But by chance, he, I went there, there's a big man, the near uh, Benaras University, be, uh, near Vishwanath Temple. Mahapu used to go there, no? That. There was a big banyan tree, under that, there is one man. Matted here, sitting, very soft behavior. I say, you can check up him. This is checking him. After that, out of curiosity, my godmother started saying, Ma, you can speak about this Maharaj. I say, I don't need to know. <laughs> I'm not ready. I don't know what to do. Anyway, finally he told, no father can kill you. They can go against you, but they cannot kill you. Be sure about it. So, I know actually Guru Bhargava is there. They can. Anyway, Sarveshwar Brahmachari, by watching his hand, that astrologer told is a miracle. All your handwriting, everything changed. How possible? After that, by the mercy of Srila Prabhupada, he took sannyas in the year of 1936. I mean, before. Popad leaving his body, I mean before Popad leaving his body, wanted to give sannyas to Sarveshwar Bhumajari. And he also, Popad wanted to give sannyas to my Guru Maharaj. But due to some reason, Popad just gone and also came in dream and giving sannyas to Guru Pad Padma. Still, in dream, if you take mantra, it's very, people cannot believe. Because people like to believe, na? So he took. So this way, he was not ready to take sannyas, but Prabhupada said, You take sannyas, I can give you sannyas. After giving sannyas, Prabhupada was ready to give him one Radha Gayatri and Radha, Radha Mantra exclusively. Almost it was not given to anybody. Maybe given to somebody, almost not given to anybody. It was given to Jajavar Goswami Maharaj. Radha Mantra and Radha Gayati, very secret. It was given to Jajwar Goswami Maharaj. Follow. One day, Pope was giving instruction to the Mott Commander, Chaitanya Mott, there at that time. Maybe it was that time Narahari Prabhu, is a Mott. As your manager was actually our uh, uh, Kunyoda, but temple in charge actually, uh, Narahari Prabhu. You give instruction to Jajabar Maharaj, he will have to go to big Dharma Sabha. Dharma Sabha, religious assembly. Different sampradaya, different group going to assembly, assemble there in Calcutta, big hall. So you can ask Jajabar Goswami Maharaj to go there and represent Gauriyamat. He has to go there to speak on behalf of Gauriyamat. After hearing this order of Prabhupada, Jajavar Goswami started crying. How I can go? I am not big Pandit. How? What I can speak? Started crying. It's not, I am not big Pandit. How I can? Very plain hearted. Then after the information was given to Prabhupada, that Jajavar, Jajavar Goswami Maharaj, Jajavar Maharaj crying. But you give order, big responsibility. How is possible for him to carry out? Popat was so strict. Popat was so strict. What is the reason of crying? He will have to go. Popat is not going to change decision. Eh? Popat is going to speak. So what is the reason for crying? He will have to go. He will have to go. What is the reason for crying? He can go. Jajabar was <laughs> crying, going there to participate in this assembly. Big assembly, all big, big pandit, they are Sanskrit pandit, big, big. They are there, religious assembly going on, on behalf of Goryamat, our Jajavar Goswami are there, very plain-hearted, humble. He started speaking in front of that big assembly. 
He started speaking in front of big assembly. After his speech was over, big, big pandit started clapping. Honor, your honor, your honor, everything, very good. Sadhu, sadhu, sadhu. When big, big pandit become very happy, they speak sadhu, sadhu, man, very good, very good. Sadhu, sadhu, sadhu. Very nice. This kind of Siddhanta is perfect. None of us here, all Pandit, all Sadhus present there, is a topmost Siddhanta established by Jajavar Goswami Maharaj. Popal laughing. Because all done by Popal. Popal is so clever. Popal is sitting there in Mayapur. If Popal is going to send a dog like me, Popal can handle me from distance. Popat can control me from distance. I know 100% evidence. From Popat is here in India. And Ban Goswami Maharaj, Goswami Maharaj, there in England, German, here. Popat is remote control. Remote control. Remote control, Popat controlling their speech, everything. You think it is not possible. I know you cannot believe. But even if I can speak about one Kormi Guru, one Kormi Guru, they are the Kormi follower. I don't like to name because it is not my intention to insult anybody. He became famous as a big, you know, tantric Shadu. Shadu actually, this word is not applicable for anybody, only for Vaishnava. Shadu, this word, is only applicable for Vaishnava, not for anybody. Whatever big kind of yogic power you attain, but sadhu, this word is not at all applicable. But that sadhu is a yogi, tantric yogi. His, his disciple going to America, Chicago, there is big religious assembly, there is giving lecture. My sisters and brothers of America, and for half an hour clapping going on. Foolish American people. But what kind of Siddhanta is speaking? All karmi. All karmi Siddhanta, no bhakti, nothing. So, what I mean to say, that Shisha, disciple, he wanted to give lecture in Chicago, America, he became famous. So, some people wanted to apply poison, some wanted to kill him. He became famous man, though he is not at all famous man. In our opinion, he is a rascal. I can prove, not I am speaking only. I can prove he is the number one rascal. Because what he is speaking, all rubbish. That man was given poison in some place. Some solution, sarbat, sarbat, you know. In a glass, very nice sarbat, giving to that man. Take, take sign. Very hot season, take sarva. He is taking the glass and going to take this, you know, this sarva, you know, solution. But inside the sarva, he can find the picture of his guru, who is staying here in North Calcutta. His yogi, Kormi guru, Kormi, tantric. Guru appear in the sarva and speaking, don't take. Poison there. Guru speaking, he is going to drink. He finds the picture of Gurudev. But you cannot believe Prabhupada. Very bad luck. I like to die. Present situation, if you ask me, I don't, I don't like to live anymore. But I don't like to live anymore by watching the situation. If they have at all believed for Prabhupada, who is Prabhupada? They could not run their life, their society this way. Hundred percent have. They have no respect for Prabhupada. Even some of the disciples, so-called disciples of Prabhupada, wanted to insult him, go away, wanted to break the Siddhanta of Prabhupada, but they could not do They went against Goryamat, they took shelter, leaving Prabhupada, they took shelter under the lotus feet of Kanupriyo Gosai, Goswami, in Samananda Parivar. Internal message, internal. Nobody knows. Whole world, no information. My luck is so good. 
Bhagavan give me so many information to speak all about this. All secret information. They took. They are living Prabhupada. Follow. They don't know who is Prabhupada. So if one Kormi Guru, Tanti Guru, can control his disciple from long distance, he is America, uh, England, going America, England, German here. So you cannot believe that Prabhupada can get control over Bon Maharaj. Prabhupada cannot control me. Prabhupada cannot help me to speak Harikatha if I am without, without any duplicity. You think so? So powerful. Prabhupada can control, Prabhupada gone. From there he can control me. So powerful. So, Jayadabha Goswami Maharaj was there in Calcutta assembly and Sira Prabhupada was there in Mayapu. Prabhupada making remote control. We should believe it. We should believe it, whatever we have done by the power of Gurudev. We should feel it. One Brahman, one Brahman, very nice Brahman, he took birth in Bengal. So powerful, doing bhajan, gayatri, everything. Suddenly, due to some reason, he changed his decision. He become heartless man. His name become Kala Pahar, Black Hill. His name was given Black Hill. He took decision to break all temples, Hindu temples. All temples in Bindavan, Kasi, everywhere. He took decision. His name, his name was Kala Pahar. Kala Pahar, Black Hill. He was successful. Breaking all temples there. That man was very powerful, Brahman. But become, change, and become so powerful. So, we can follow Rudra. Rudra, Rudra Dev. Rudra Dev is the goddess of destruction. You can go to Bhagavatam, you can find Neel, Lohito, so many Rudra. They are very angry attitude, destructive attitude. So, Shaktabe's avatar, this word, if somebody is speaking to somebody, that doesn't mean we'll have to follow them. There's so many meaning, inner meaning. Nakul Bhamachari was Shaktavesh Bhagavan Gauranga Mahapu coming from Puri and entered into the body of Nakul Bhamachari. Shivananda Sen wanted to prove him, wanted to prove that whether it is right or wrong. Shivananda Sen, the eternal person of Gauranga Mahapu, he was not ready to accept that Bhagavan Chaitanya Mahapu coming in here in Kalna, near Kalna. He's how I went there 18, 20 years back, 22 years back. Now no time. Shivananda says, speaking, well, let me test. Let me test my Prabhu coming here or not. Let me test. Then Shivananda staying long away, not going to enter. And the Nukul Mamuchari Nukul is speaking. You call Sivananda, they are standing, not coming to me. He has some doubt about me. I know Sivananda speaking. If Nakul Bhamachari can speak what mantra I am chanting, then I can believe he is Gauranga Mahapu coming. Yes. Then Nakul Bhamachari, when Sivananda coming, I know you are chanting ten syllable, ten syllable mantra. Then Sivananda said, yes now. Is now my Prabhu. Nityananda, our Advaita Gosai wanted to prove Gauranga Mahapu. Advaita Gosai many times, Advaita was no 100%, but many times wanted to prove whether this is my Prabhu coming or not. Purposely. I told you, Advaita Gosai wanted to play the roles of one representative on behalf of all common people. The common people having some doubt. So, Advaita Gosai represented, representing us. So, he purposely going to express some doubt and, and try to solve. Like the case of 
like the case of our Parikhit Maharaj. Do you think Parikhit Maharaj foolish? Parikhit Maharaj, do you think Parikhit Maharaj can have some doubt about Rasa Leela? But purposely Parikhit Maharaj could put in question. So that solution can come and all common people can have the way out. Parikhit Maharaj, come on, is Mahabhagavad, Mahabhagavad. In Bhagavatam, four place. Four place it is written. That Esho Mahabhagavata is Mahabhagavad. Not only that, who took darshan of Bhagavan inside womb of mother? Even before taking birth, even before taking birth, he took darshan of Bhagavan inside womb. He can have any doubt about Krishna Raslila. He can speak this way. Aptokam Jodhipati hi kitabana bhujju upsita. Krishna has done all rubbish thing. Why? Why? Aptokam Jodhipati hi kitabana bhujju upsita. Surely don't. It is purposely this question. Purposely, purposely. If Parikitma is not going to put question, whole world, even our devotees, they cannot believe Krishna. What is the inner meaning? So he wanted to put question in front of Parikit Maharaj, so that Parikit Maharaj can give answer that Bhagavan Sri Krishna is sitting inside the heart of all creature, even insect, even mosquito, everywhere, Bhagavan sitting now, inside her. The Parikit Maharaj wanted to give a big, nice answer. But one answer, if you so many answer, Parikit Maharaj wanted to, Sukhdev Goswami wanted to speak. That Bhagavan is sitting inside the heart of everybody as a super soul. As a super soul. How it is possible for him to do any wrong thing? Gopinam tatpatinam cha. Gopinam tatpatinam cha. Sarvesham eva dehinam jantas charaha. Sha adhyaksha kurk kirana neha deho bhag. How excellent answer. So many answer, I give you one answer. Which is acceptable for you very easily. Parikhidma speaking, as Shukdev Goswami speaking, inside the heart of all gopi. Parik Shukdev Goswami giving answer. Inside the heart of all gopi, inside the heart of the husband of all gopi. Inside the heart of all creature in infinity world, who is there? Krishna. So what wrong in it? If the super soul coming out to play with them, to satisfy them. He has no self-desire. Only wanted to fulfill the desire of gopikas. Not that he is going to enjoy with one woman. So what is nice answer? Gopinam tatpatinam cha sarvesham eva dehinam jantas charaha Shadhyaksha kirana neho deho bhag. To play with them, Bhagavan purposely to satisfy them, coming out. Excellent Leela, Rasa Leela. You are, going, you are going to accept this Rasa Leela as a very, very dirty thing. Because you are dirty. You are dirty. You are coming from hell. You are coming from hell. That's why you are going to accept Rasa Leela. Introduction on Rasa Leela. I spoke for a long time, you can find. Introductory speech on Rasa Leela. Full, so many Harikatha on this only particular topics. To break the misconception of people. I am giving all my blood, everything, whatever I possession I have, I am giving to you all. But still people are, because they are in confusion. Some Acharya spoke this, some Acharya spoke this, some wrote this. Who is going to obey me? I am not important personality. Though I am speaking absolute, but they cannot accept. But someday they can accept. Someday they can accept. They can realize. So, Jajavar Goswami Maharaj was topmost in the assembly. So many incidents I can say, how much dedicated cell after Prabhupada gone, after Prabhupada gone, some of our God, some of our Guru Bhargava, like Madhu Goswami Maharaj, Prasanthu Goswami Maharaj, Jajavar Goswami Maharaj, they all 
together wanted to establish in Mad in Midnapur. Wanted to make one Mad in Midnapur that was also in an old building. That was a ghost building, ghost. That was abandoned. That building was abandoned for a long time. I was there a long time as speak Harikatha. Many times. Now I am not going. It is called Samananda Goryaman in Minnapur. There was ghost, full of ghost. Then our Madhugusi Maj, Santugusi, they are requesting to that landlord, you can give this, uh, this building, it's ghost building. If you like to take, you go, okay, I can give you a name. They're going to write in the name of, they make one committee. When they are speaking Harikatha, big, big stone, that ghost throwing, bam! They pass us on. Yeah, Harikatha speaking. One big stone coming, doom, on the Basasan. Cannot kill the speaker. But they are powerful, Madhu they are all powerful. Already the ghost gone by hearing Sankirtan, and very nice deity was installed there. Very nice. Madhu they all started preaching. Finally, Madhu making, Parambuja Madhu making so many temples, our Santu Maharaj, those small, I mean younger brother, Lord, making so many preaching and meeting, so many buildings, so many uh, temples. So Jajapur Goswami Maharaj is very tranquil, very, very soft heart, not running here and there. So all devotees took decision, we can give this temple in the name of our elder God brother, Jajapur Goswami. It's more practical, there's no temple. So the temple was given to him. Finally, he was successful to make one temple in Kathi. Actually, he took birth there in Durmut, near Kathi. From Kathi, only 10-12 kilometers. I went to the uh, Avirva place of Jayadvara Goswami Maharaj. Long ago. So, he was successful to make a temple there in Kathi. Finally, one lady, widow, one lady, widow lady, he wanted to give big, Big area of land together with one deity. Two in the name of Jajavaru Simha. It was in Chandrakana, in Mindapur, very historical place. Also, there are many, many Bengali Harikatha there. Many. But now I am not going. I went there. Very nice area. Chandrakana city. Very nice temple. Sam Chand. Name of the deity is Samchat. Very nice. So, Jajavar Goswami Maharaj, usually he was very much interested to do Harinam and Harikatha. Usually he is not running here and there. Not running to make disciples. No. Hey, somebody forcefully coming. Ah, oh, you give me. Somehow, you can test and used to give. Otherwise, he was less interested. He was very. One day, Kartik Bruto going to start and Maharaj picks up his program there in Kathi. But the in charge of the Maud speaking, Maharaj, how we can run? How we can run for one month? Kartik Bruto, so many people can come, but there is no rice, no dal, nothing there in stock. Jadev Goswami, Jadev Goswami is laughing. Jadev Goswami is laughing. You have no, no rice, no dal in your stock? Eh? Go, go, lock the door, outside door. Why, why, why? Go, I seek. Lock the door, outside. And noon time, you start doing Sankirtan. Start doing Sankirtan. All devotees there started doing Sankirtan. Sankirtan there. And Jajavur Semaraj, lock the door. I mean, he give order to Brahmacharya, lock the door, give the key with me. And the Brahmacharya giving the key to Maharaj. And Maharaj going upstairs and doing and doing Harinam. In the meantime, one man going to knock the door. Open, open, open. Who is calling? Who knows? Maharaj from upstairs, watching from the window, some man coming to call. Giving the key to the brahmachari, hey, you go and open the door, somebody coming. You open the door, and the man speaking, 
some, uh, somebody going to send all rice, big, big, you know, sack, so many sack of rice, you know, sack of rice, dal, ghee, ghee, oil, everything, all species, spices, everything. Brahmacharya, they all gone mad. Hey? Just, I, we told to Gurudev, there is no shortage. Immediately, Krishna is sending everything. And Brahmachari asking to the man and the van man who is going to carry the car. Who is, who is going to send? But we don't know the name. One man going to buy everything and load me and he, uh, your fare, your car fare, he already pay. He already pay car fare also. Who are the name of the man? I don't know the name. He just speak. He just give me instruction, go to the temple, go to the temple and deliver all rice, everything to them. So Jajavar Goswami speaking in Harikatha, don't worry about the shortage of dal, chal, chapati, mani, don't be up. Do bhajan. It is the responsibility of Bhagavan. It is the responsibility of Bhagavan. Why are you unnecessarily going like foolish man, going to waste your time in foreign country to collect money? You are going to spoil your own life, you don't know. Your whole life is spoiled. You like to deliver other na. You like to deliver other na, but I can prove hundred percent. Your life is spoiled. You like to deliver other na, but first of all you try to deliver yourself. Your life is spoiled. Unless you going. That much power you don't have. So that you can go and deliver outside people. They are fallen so. They are running their life like a reckless driving. Outside people, they are leading their life a reckless driver, reckless driving. And life is out of control. So how you can control? You try to control yourself. So Jajavar Goswami Maharaj, in the afternoon time Harikatha, evening time Harikatha speaking, Ananyasintanto Jejana Mam Parjubasati Tesham Nitya Nityavi Yuktanam Yogokema Baham Maham. Srila Bhakti Vita Madhav Goswami used to respect him very much. So simple hearted. Jajabhar Goswami, no complicacy. Even when we have, you have seen Bhakti Puri Goswami, you have seen in your life? Never seen. You have never seen. If you, what to speak? Those who have idea about him, you can know. Even more simple than a five years child by. Five years old, the child has some complicacy due to his previous sanskar. But it's a more, like a, a small baby. No complicacy. Siddhar Maharaj, they are all. So they can cheat you by giving big title to you. To cheat you. Vaishnavas, I can, tomorrow I can also speak some Harikatha. Very important day. The Vaishnavas can sometimes cheat you. Two type of kipa. Vaishnav can give you kippah different way. One kippah is false kippah. By glorifying, oh, you are great by giving this. One, another kind of kippah by chiding you, huh? Useless. This is actual kippah. Actual kippah. So, Vaishnavas can cheat you. Mahaprabhu also wanted to cheat. So one kind of cheating word I cannot use to prove to prove that he is actually. Uh, but I am giving ex example from Chaitanya Chaitanya, Chaitanya Bhagavat, from Bhagavatam, different place, Mahavarat, all from different. Even directly, all countless quotation I am speaking in front of you, of Prabhupada. But still, ah, oh, you confusion. You must be in confusion because you are not devotee. You are not coming here to do bhajan, so you are in confusion. If you are, if you are hundred percent perfect, no complicacy, sincere, I can put guarantee in Vasasana. Then you can also get result from me. I am not cheating anybody. I am not cheating anybody. I am not cheating anybody. So you are hundred percent going to get exact vichar from me. But if you don't like to rely me. You can go anywhere you like. You get lost. You get lost. So, Vaishnavas, Prabhupada speaking, they can cheat you. 
if you are cheater, you are very sincere, very simple, no offense, no offense there inside your heart, then they can take you in their own lap. Come, come on, sit in my lap. Very clever. Very clever there. So, Jayadavar Goswami Maharaj, not highly educated. That doesn't mean he never went to foreign country. That doesn't mean he was a useless people. 100% pure devotees. Those who are pure devotees, they need not go anywhere. My Guru Patman told me, if your Acharan, if your Siddhanta Vichar, if your etiquette is all perfect, you can find all people can come to you. They are bound to come. Those who are sincere, they are bound to come to you. You need not go anywhere. Like honeybees, they are coming where honey is there. Guru Maharaj, teach me. You need not be. Let them do whatever they like. So, Popa is also speaking the same Siddhanta to get established, to get established in the Achar Adarsho of Gauranga Mahapu is to become a great preacher. What is the designation of a preacher? Who is established in the Acharan Adarsha idealism of Gauranga Mahapu? He is a topmost preacher. So, Jadavar Goswami Maharaj is number one preacher. Bhaktala Paramahansa Maharaj is number one preacher. Gaur Kishore Das Bhaji Maharaj, number one preacher. Not going. They need not go to foreign country. They can influence the whole world by their acharan, by their siddhanta, by the etiquette. They can change. They need not go. They need not go. They can do it from here. That's why I don't speak in you need not go. Somebody, those who are qualified, they can go. I am not speaking you need not go. Some qualified. I have archer and they can go. I cannot go, that up to them. I'm not, who am I to give suggestion to you? So, this way Jajabar Goswami Maharaj was so perfect Siddhanta Vishal. Very nice. Any Siddhanta Vishal. One day, when Srila Madhav Goswami Maharaj was very much anxious to to re-establish the Avirva place of Prabhupada. So many. Nobody going to help him. Those who have billions of dollars in their bank, bank, they didn't want to help Madhu Goswami Maharaj. Very, very rich man there. They never want to help. Madhu Goswami Maharaj is very anxious. So court case going on, like water, money going. So, Madhu Goswami Maharaj, when come out successful, I mean, in court case, he was successful, then he wanted to make one big festival, even the temple going to be constructed, not construction done. Madhu Goswami Maharaj could not say, go away from this world. Follow. Construction going on. In the meantime, he wanted to arrange one big festival of Prabhupada Avirvaptiti. That time, he wanted to invite all God brothers. You come, come and bless me. You call, come, come and bless me, all God brothers. You come. Jajavar Goswami Maharaj, after getting information, immediately running, coming here, attending the festival, singing kirtan, everything. So many I don't like to speak because time cannot permit. After that, after that, Madhu Goswami is speaking. All your cooperation, all your cooperation, I need, I need all your blessing and cooperation. Otherwise, it is impossible for me to do. In the meantime, Sri Jajavar Goswami has started speaking one word. One word. Madhavo, Madhavo Bachi, Madhavo, Madhavo Hidi, Sarva Karjesu Madhavam. Suddenly speak this word. Then Madhu Goswami could realize, my God brother is going to bless me with this word. That you alone is more than sufficient. You need not anybody's help, our help. Practically it was so. All God brothers, they wanted, all mean some of God brothers. They wanted to give some money. But that money was so futile amount. That amount was so futile amount. It is nothing. 
<laughs> Lakhs of rupees need. Who can give? Madhu Goswami could realize my God brother, Jadavar Goswami is going to bless me by this word. Really so. Madhu Goswami is successful alone. Alone. Successful. To make a big temple. To, to discover, I mean, re-establish the Avirvap Sali of Sila Prabhupada. All the way, all the time, Srila Jadra Goswami used to help Madhu Goswami Maharaj. Any time, any, any assembly. Someday I can discover the mood of Madhu Goswami Maharaj. Now, no time. Madhu Goswami Maharaj was such a personality. He, who wanted to follow Prabhupada in total, this declaration was given by almost all of his God, like my Guru Maharaj, Siddhar Maharaj, all, everybody. Bon Maharaj, Bon Maharaj bursted into tears. Bon Maharaj bursted into tears when speaking something about the Biraha Tithi of Silam Adho Goswami. He spoke that he is the only person who wanted to follow the order of Prabhupada in Toto. Maybe it is out of humbleness. We could not follow Prabhupada hundred percent. He's speaking out of humbleness. Because before leading before leaving before leading before leaving this material world, Prabhupada told under the shelter of one Asrai Vigraha, you all together amicably try to preach the message of Guru Gauranga that was successful in the life of Madhu Goswami. He was never envious with anybody. Always, any assembly, my God, brother, you come, come, there is Harikatha, we can go. He never wanted to express any jealousy. Always. Always wanted. God, brother, come, 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 come. Harikatha, you can speak. Not alone, to, to collect love, puja, position, never. You cannot prove. You cannot prove even a single instant. Single instant, you cannot prove that Madhu Goswami Maharaj was doing anything along secretly. All in front of all God was. You all like cordially invited. You call, you come, you bless me. You bless me. Who am I? I cannot do without your help. That was Madhu Goswami. And Jajabar Goswami Maharaj was very happy with him. So, also with, you know, Siddhar Goswami Maharaj. All assembly, everywhere, Jajogosima used to speak Harikatha and Kirtan, especially Kirtan and Harikatha. One day in Calcutta, Chaitanya Gorima, there was a big assembly. Big assembly. Then district magistrate, district and a magistrate all invited quietly. To uh, there is a is a rule because if any important person coming, people can give more attention. That is the rule. His name I forget. He was sitting in the chair, all Harikatha going on, everything going on. Harikatha was over and before Shabha was dissolved, by that time Shabha was not dissolved. But the president of the meeting already took permission from Madhu Goswami Maharaj. I have some appointment, I will have to go very urgently. Before you dissolve your, I will have to go, please Maharaj. Okay, okay. okay. So when the Sobha is over, immediate, Sobha is over, Kirtan going on, not everybody, not totally. Then immediately the president, who was elected president of the Sobha, immediately coming and the Guard is there, bodyguard, everything. They're going to take uh, him and he is going to enter going to enter into going to board board his car, private car. In the meantime, Jajavar Gusema started doing kirtan. Jajavar Gusema started doing kirtan. Ah. As if all temple 
all the particles in the temple, they are going to vibrate. You cannot believe my word, because you have no practical experience. You never heard the Hari, Harikirtan from the mouth of Jadavar Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Bhutan Turi Goswami Maharaj. You have no idea. That's why you cannot believe. You have no practical belief. After hearing this Kirtan, that the president, important man, I mean that, you know, district, you know, immediately coming back and sitting in the asana again. Everybody in the he gone and sitting in the asana again. Sitting, sitting in the asana with full attention, with full attention he is hearing the Kirtan. After the Kirtan is over, with folded hand, going to request Madhu Goswami Maharaj. Maharaj, I have, I have one request. Tomorrow is my holiday. You can bring this sannyasi, all sannyasi in my house. I like to do kirtan, because very auspicious kirtan. This kind of kirtan I never heard. My heart going to break down by hearing this kirtan. Could you please? Mother would say, yes, I can bring. So Jajabhagya Sri Maharaj went there in the house of that district magistrate. So you understand. When Jajabhagya Sri Maharaj used to do kirtan, almost whole temple, even Bhagavan deity used to shake. I mean, this guy, you never, you cannot believe me, I know. I know you cannot believe me because you have no, practically you never seen. You have never seen Bhakti Bhavan Puri Goswami. You have never seen Sridhar Goswami Maharaj. You have never seen Krishnadas Babaji Maharaj. You have never seen Madhu Goswami Maharaj. You have never seen Jadavar Goswami Maharaj. How you can believe? So you can speak all rubbish against our Guru Bhargava. They are all useless, they are idiot, rascal, they are failure. It's not good. Anyhow, any kind of judgment you can speak against the Siddhanta, you cannot, you cannot establish. Because I am speaking, what Siddhanta Vichar. I promised you to explain all the sloka previous, previous week. But today also time finished. So I promise you tomorrow I can like to do. Tomorrow I can. Nayatra Vaikunta Katha Sudhapaga or other sloka I discussed yesterday also. So I can discuss. I like to discuss tomorrow. Uh, please come on time. So. Jeva Muishe Kita Sohidatha Jane Shude Antara Bartikesu Dehe Sujayat Majar Hati Matsu Naprit Yukta Javadatha Shaloke Vanchakalpatur Shikapas in the way. Patitan Babana Pavishnu.